Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Devin Christopher. Sorry I'm filming out here in the rain. Kevin is taking a nap right now. Okay, so I'm very excited. This is my first Coach Rogue, if you didn't see that in the title already. I never thought I would get one of these because they're like $800. But this one actually went to the outlet for 75% off. And when I checked last night, it was still on there for 60% off. But uh, when I ordered it, they were having like an extra 15% off. So, so excited about the deal I got on this. But I never thought I would get one of these. Now this is not the chalk color. They call it ivory, which I don't have a chalk bag either, but I know my friend Yoda loves the chalk ones. But this color is called Ivory, and I'm happy to see it's a little packed up still. Okay, so I've never seen one of these in real life, so I was just expect inspecting the handles for a minute. It makes me nervous how this hard piece is under the leather. I'm afraid it might come out eventually. And I do see one little dimple in the leather here. It's the only imperfection I've seen so far. And you might be able to tell already this beautiful design that it has on it. So um, at first I couldn't totally tell what it was, but I looked up a picture and it's uh, sun, well, so it's lipstick, matches, nail polish, sunglasses, and these are like a beaded necklace. And then there seems to be like a sort of an impression of a Rolex watch over here. Oh, that fly was a paid actor. <clears throat> so, uh, so it's got these short little Dior-like handles that remind me of the Lady Dior. I always thought these looked uncomfortable the way that they're hard, but um, the leather on it makes it soft, but they are a stiff handle. Um, so I'm curious how that will feel. It doesn't seem bad though, honestly. But we'll see how it goes once I have it all stuffed. Okay, so let me get the wrapping off of here so we can appreciate her in all her glory. For those of you who haven't clicked away already, I appreciate you guys being here. Oh. Oh. So this ivory color, I couldn't tell what it was going to look like online. So there's a little hair that's been, a little piece of fuzz that's been sealed into the bag. I don't know if you can see that. But considering the price I got it for, I'm okay with that because it's originally an $800 bag. And I got it for, like I said, 75% off. So I don't know if I will ever use these shoulder straps, but that's a nice option if you ever want to be able, maybe you're like grocery shopping or something and you need to be hands-free, then that's a nice option. Let's get some of the stuffing out of here. Oh, cool. So this is the first time I've seen one of these. I've never even looked at one in the store, but it actually has like a little pocket here on the front of the back instead of the Coach Creed. Actually, I don't even see a Coach Creed in here at all. Maybe it's on the inside of the zipper pocket. But yeah, so we've got a big leather pocket on the back side of the bag. And we've got the tiny leather pocket on this side. Uh, sorry if you've already seen a Rogue before. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm just trying to get all the packaging off of here. Oh, I love these giant zipper pulls. So it has these big, heavy zipper pulls. The only other bag that I've ever bought full price from Coach, well, I didn't buy this full price, but the only bag that I've got from the Coach Boutique um, was the Pillow Tabby 26 in the Jade, which is not the same as the forest green that they're selling now. Um, and even that bag didn't have this substantial hardware like this. This has really nice zipper pulls on it. And that bag also did not have the little... They didn't give me the tag. I thought I was going to get the little metal tag. They showed the picture of the metal tag online. Well, I was excited to get the metal tag, but 
This one just came with a Coach and Tom Wesselman tag. They showed the metal tag online. That's disappointing. I thought it was going to be my first little metal tag, which is a stupid thing to care about because those little chains that they put them on, it's just going to fall right off of the bag, isn't it? Okay. So it has a pocket on either side, aside from the little pockets on the sides of the bag. I'm very eloquent today. And then it has this middle compartment that's separated by a zipper. And it looks like we have a whole nother strap in here. Coach always comes through with the strap option. Make your bags versatile. Oh, I love Coach. It's such good quality. I mean, there is a piece of fuzz lacquered on here. But aside from that, I mean, for the price, you can't beat it. This reminds me so much of a Lady Dior with the handles and then the tote size of the bag. Most of my bags are very small and don't hold very much, so I'm very excited to have a tote bag in my collection. This is so pretty. It actually has like a metallic gold here on the lipstick and on the top of this um, nail polish bottle. And then there's actual little sparkles here on the beads. I'm very impressed with the detail on this. Okay. That's nice, the handles just fold right up if you wanna use the shoulder strap. This also comes with a crossbody strap, which I will probably never use, but most girls always wanna add a crossbody strap, so I can definitely see why they added this. So I will show you guys for those of you who are interested. Because like I said, this is still, 60% off on the website right now, which is like, I think it said 316 last I checked, which is still way better than 800. I mean, if you're like me and you've always wanted a Rogue, but never wanted to spend the money on one. I like this, the, uh, this piece of hardware here. The little metal peg for it is curved. Sorry, little details like that impress me. Okay, so it's got this really nice strap. It looks very similar to the strap that came with my pillow tabby, uh, but it's in this beige color, so I don't know if I'll ever use it, but. I mean, it has these lovely shoulder straps, so I wouldn't, I guess maybe if these shoulder straps weren't big enough for you, then you would definitely need the crossbody, but I doubt I will ever use this, honestly. Because, I mean, it already has these extra shoulder straps that I don't need, so. Coach quality is so good. If you notice, the word coach is turned the same direction on each of these little rivets, which I think is really impressive. A lot of luxury houses don't do that. And it also says coach on the insides of each of the rivets, and they're also lined up. They're each lined up the same direction. I love this chunky hardware. Yeah, I definitely want to, wouldn't want to pay $800 for a Rogue, but I'm very happy at the price that I got it at. So I won't keep you guys any longer. I love you. I hope you have the best day. And that is one thing to note if you order it, that they don't give you the 1941 tag, um, which is weird because the 1941 tag was pictured on the, the ad that I looked at. But anyway... I don't care that much. I would have just lost it eventually anyway. Oh, okay, I was wrong. The Coach Creed is on the inside of the zipper bit. We've got another pocket in here. The button's closed. And the little Coach Creed is there. And uh, if you guys want to leave, I hope you have the best day. But for anyone who's interested, I will show you guys what fits in here. So... I don't usually carry this around, but I just wanted to show you guys that it could fit a glasses case. This is my Givenchy glasses case for my glasses that I took off because they really reflect the ring light really bad. <laughs> so I've got my six ring key holder. Put that maybe in this pocket on the side. And then I've got my new card coin holder. I bet that will fit in this large pocket on the back of the bag. And it fits easily in there. There's just a little extra space so it slides in and out easy. I've got my, this is my COVID passport. Maria 
from Maria Louise Loves Luxuries gave me this beautiful uh, lizard effect passport. So I'll put this on the back side of my bag. Got my Chanel mirror, which will fit in this little slip pocket right here that they put for cards, I suppose. So my little Chanel mirror will fit right in there. And then I've just got my headphones and I need to get my little coin holder from inside. But you can see all my stuff fits in there. Obviously it's a small tote bag, so you can get all your essentials in there for sure. Um, and it's much bigger than most of my bags, so this will hold more than what I would want to carry on a regular basis. So yeah, if you were thinking about one of these, um, it did come in a little rougher shape than I thought it would. Uh, but again, I did get a much higher quality bag for a much lower price. So I'm very happy with this. It is absolutely stunning. I would say you can probably get just as good quality on the Coach Outlet, but they obviously wouldn't have like a limited edition collaboration like this. Um, I really love uh, realism because I can't do it myself. <laughs> I'm not, I never liked to draw from life. I like to just draw out of my own head. So obviously I'm not good at realism, um, but I am impressed when people can do it. So. I love Tom Wesselman's work now that I'm familiar with him. I didn't know who he was before I saw this bag, but I had to look him up after I saw this gorgeous design on this bag. I love Jesse Styles' puzzle bag that has um, the mouse from Spirited Away and the little fly. It's actually a, a baby. Um, the, anyway, if you haven't seen Spirited Away, you need to watch that movie. But um, she has the Spirited Away puzzle bag. and. This design printed on here reminded me very much of that. It's obviously not that same high level technique. I think this is just, you know, embossed and printed, but I really love how it looks. And I told you guys all my bags that I acquire from now on have to have something special about them. So I am so happy with this. And I don't have any colors like this. I don't ever uh, lean toward neutrals um, in my bags. I have a lot of neutral clothing, but I don't have any neutral bags to go with it. So. This will be a lovely addition to my collection, and I love the little bit of fun here on the side. Okay, I love you guys. I hope you have the best day. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Oh my gosh, I meant to wear my bucket hat. I'm so sorry. My hair probably looks like doo-doo. <laughs> okay, I hope you guys have the best day. Bye. <laughs>